if you are married to a military member and your divorce decree says you're entitled to a portion of their military retirement, there are some very specific rules that have to be followed. You have to have very specific language in your divorce decree or DFAS will not accept it. You have to have a separate division retirement order that has very specific language. It's really important for you to have an attorney on your side who will draft those documents and make sure that they get sent in to DFAS in time. They need to be sent in within one year of the date of your divorce. My name is Laura Hurd, and I'm an attorney who has practiced family law in San Antonio, Texas since 1987. And I've done many, many retirement orders for the military service members. I can also tell you that a lot of people come to me later and they have not received their, their military retire pay. It is sometimes we are able to fix it and sometimes we can't. If too much time has gone by, or if you weren't married for at least 10 years, overlapping with 10 years of credible military service, DFAS is not going to send the money directly to you, but that doesn't mean you're not entitled to it. If your divorce decree says you're supposed to get it, and DFAS doesn't send it to you, then your ex-spouse is required to send it to you every month. As soon as they get their military retired pay, they need to, to give you the portion that, is in, that you're entitled to under the divorce decree. And if they don't, you can file suit to enforce that.